The Harvey Weinstein sex abuse scandal caused many men to feel a new sympathy for mistreated women until feminists started talking about it and then we stopped feeling sympathy and just felt sort of annoyed. One feminist named Helen Rosner has issued a series of tips on Twitter for how men can support women that are guaranteed to make men never want to support women ever again. I am not making this up. These are her real tips. Helen Rosner's tip number one for how men should react to the Harvey Weinstein scandal is overcome your transphobia because trans women are women. This is an excellent tip, except for the fact that trans women are not women and nobody's phobic about them and they have nothing to do with Harvey Weinstein. Other than that, it's great. Tip number two is be pro-abortion. I guess this is important because if you molest the woman you work with and she becomes pregnant, you want to be able to kill the baby. That'd be a big improvement. Tip number three, ask your workplace if tampons and pads are free. When they explain to you that nothing is free, ask women to go out and pay for their own damn tampons and pads. Tip number six, and I'm still not making these up, tip number six is whenever you are in a group of only men, ask yourself why. I already know why, it's so I don't have to listen to crap like this. Tip number seven, Cultivate genuine, intimate, non-sexual friendships with women. I have no idea what that means. I'm not even sure it's in English. Tip number eight, seek out women to be your heroes and mentors. These <laughs> feminists, they crack me up. Tip number 12, when you need support, reach out to men as well as women. Create a culture of openness around yourself. If you're gay, if you're not gay, don't do this. You'll get punched in the face. Tip number 16, do everything you can to empower black women and NBWOC. NBWOC, of course, stands for Nibwok. They're those furry little creatures from the Star Wars movies. Apparently, they're oppressed. And tip number 17, befriend children. Unless they're in the womb, then kill them. So, friends, if you, like me, feel outraged and disgusted by Harvey Weinstein, just read these helpful feminist tips, and you'll just kind of forget the whole thing and go about your business. Thanks, feminists. Trigger warning, I'm Andrew Clavin, and you can watch The Andrew Clavin Show Monday through Thursday right here at The Daily Wire.